whites can help us, but they can't join us. They can, there can be no black-white unity until there is first some black unity. We cannot think of being acceptable to others until we have first proven acceptable to ourselves. Concerning nonviolence, it is criminal to teach a man not to defend himself when he is the constant victim of brutal attacks. There are problems in the community. Uh, some of those examples of those problems are, are the uh, uh, vices that destroy the moral fiber in our community. Drunkenness, uh, drug addiction, uh, prostitution, organized crime that robs the Negro community of probably 90% of its economic potential and, uh, and moral potential. One of uh, my reasons for going out on the limb as I have is to try and make white people uh, be shocked awake to some of their senses because if they don't awake, they're going to find out that this little Negro that they thought was passive has become a roaring, uncontrollable lion right, in, right at their door, not at their doorstep, inside their house, in their bed, in their kitchen, in their attic, in their basement. And if you know that in time, you can do something about it.